Mercenary Field in Chirac, Illinois is the setting for today's MFL action. The historic site is where aliens first made contact with Earth, landing their spaceships inside the stadium and demanding a lifetime supply of Italian beef sandwiches. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers. The Green Bay Attackers battle the Midway Mutants. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> and MFL Game Day is on the air. Grim Blitzrow and my partner Brickhead Mulligan and Mini Bricks. Heard you got a little touch of the mutant bird and pig flu. How you feeling, partner? Well, uh, the projectile vomiting finally let up, but uh, the monsoon mudslides have begun. <laughs> if you know what I mean. I've been, oh. I've been literally crapping his brains out all night. He's getting stupider by the hour, if that's even possible. He was starting to go somewhere, but he gets stumped after three. They usually stop me after three, too. You know, the all-you-can-eat buffets? They're not as literal as you'd think. Second down and seven. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. Oh, son. And it's first and ten. And then catch will give them a first down. And it's first and ten. And he picks up about six on the play. And that'll be second down and four. Some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners there. Straight through the uprights. <laughs> Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. It's first and ten. Caught for the first down. And it's first and ten. Dirty trick. The quarterback unleashes and he scores! Say what? Come on, man. You can't hang with me. You get my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. You understand me? Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Right through. Yeah, like a double step 
burrito from Taco Hell. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. And this guy is making a name for himself tonight with a pickup of about ten on that play. Hey, he makes up a name for himself every night. That's how he stays ahead of the bounty hunters. He's wanted in 50 states. When the receiver runs away from the pass marker, that's a good clue that something's not right. down and a pussy here. And this guy runs angry and runs hard. First down. And it's first and ten. Second down and long. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! Hey, man, he was going to get him out. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> the kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. First and ten. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. Well, B five fo fum. He is fighting for every man. What a hit that was. Second down, the size of Brick's wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. And that is caught for a first down. And it's first and ten. Second down and a lot. The cornerback goes down. Zoom on his face. I want to see if he's crying. Third down and the punter is warming up. to that one for a first down. And it's first and ten. 
It's anyone's game at the end of quarter one. And it's first and ten. Oh, great catch! And that's a touchdown! Touchdown! And they line up for the extra point. It's good. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Oh, killer hit, literally. I love how they explode into a shower of blood and guts. Yeah, the pieces of him are flying into the cheap seats. Fans will have a nice souvenir to take home. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. First and four. And he rumbles into the end zone for the score. I hope he's not going to dance now. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. Straight through the uprights. <laughs> the home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. Oh, this guy just loves punishing the defenders. That's a first down. And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. And it's first and ten. Until he's a berserker because he's frothing at the mouth. Oh, and that's the way to get the sticks moving. He takes up five yards on that play. Second down and five. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. And that's some good old fashioned downhill running as he picks up nine yards on the play. And that'll bring up second and one. First and ten. 
And he picks up 10 on that run. Man, he nearly broke that one open, Bricks. Yeah, and I nearly married Trim Bedassian. And I nearly did not crap my pants earlier. Nearly as overrated, Grim. Second down in inches. That was a nice piece of running, Grim. That's a first down. First down and seven. And that's just a great run for a touchdown. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. First and ten. Man, this guy just blew up and he's on fire. I'm not talking about one of those video game fire modes. I mean, literally, he's like burning bacon down there. First down! He hit that line the way it rolled up down the bill, sticking out a flimsy low hand's nose. It's a mare. And we're at the two-minute warning. I gotta pee. And it's first and ten. heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Catch the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole up here. Talking to you. And he sticks his fingers in the defender's eyes, netting him a pickup of about eight on the play. Smart move there, stopping the clock with their first time out. And for all you know, maybe he's just stalling or wiring the ref some cash. Third and two. First down! He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. The QB saved some clock by calling a timeout. They have one left. And it's first and ten. up the first down that's it that's their last time out it's them against the other team and the clock well, that doesn't seem fair i'm gonna throw a hammer on the field and even the odds and he just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown Should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. First and ten. And he picks up maybe four on that play. 
The quarterback calls a timeout to stop the clock. They have two left. And the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what's the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense calls plays at the line of scrimmage and plays really fast. Why would they do that? If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And that'll bring up third and... The quarterback is controlling the clock like the clock is into it. I know I am. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry-up. Uh, same as Brits' ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she called it rabbit sex. I don't... And it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yes, the second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room, and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. It's the start of the third quarter, and we are set to go, Bricks. Oh, boy! Where are we going, Grim? A carnival? Huh? I'm gonna go look for a striptease show. Where are we going? Yeah. Hey, why don't you settle down? Just pet your rabbit, Lenny. Just pet your rabbit. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! Oh, what a brutal hit! And it's first to ten. Oh, that was a big hit! Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. And he just slipped away like a grip. Ooh, that hit's gonna shave a few days off his life. Third and two. was an all-pro NFL hit. And it's first and ten. And he'll pick up seven yards on that play. Second and three. Third down and, well, good luck. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. And it's first and ten. Cribbling? It certainly left skid marks. First in the three. And the crowd goes wild. Touchdown! Touchdown! And if you don't understand why refs are hated even more than kickers, <laughs> well, there's your answer, Bricks. Here on 
time for offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery First down in a mile. I'm going to say maybe three yards, but a tough three yards. Second down and ain't going to happen, partner. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. Third down and forever. One time when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. And it's good! You know, Grim, in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good, huh? I mean, can we all just... Not this shit again. Brex, I'm stomping it right there. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he... Ouch! What is this, Andy's wrestling? And it's first and ten. There was an explosion, but everyone's walking away from it. Them cool guys always walk away from explosions. Hey, that might be good for the movies, but it's awful for the NFL. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. Third down and five. Man, he's running like a bull on steroids. That'll be a first down. And it's first and ten. Nice pickup for six yards. And that'll be second down and four. He had it for a second there. Third and four. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. And it's first and ten. He blasted and picks up seven yards right there. Second and three. And he held on to that one for a first down. First and eight to go. And picks up maybe a deuce at most. Uh, speaking of deuces, I got a... Uh... <clears throat> Should have been here in the old days. They used to mark their territory the old-fashioned way. But they agreed to dial it down to uh, interpretive dance. I took an interpretive dance class with a werewolf once, Grim. He damn near clawed my face off. Uh, that was before the class even started. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Oh, what a great defensive play that 
was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. That's the end of the third quarter. This game is going to come down to the wire. And it's first and ten. And he picked up a lot of real estate in a hurry. Give him ten yards right there. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. What a throw. That sonic blast just cleared the field for the... Re oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. Yo, man, nobody can touch me when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? And it's first and ten. <laughs> Holy crap, he runs straight into a mutant trap and dies. Reminds me of my breakfast cereal, the old nut crunch. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> It's like our Brazilian season, dumbass. Actually, I think he's talking about the time warp dirty trick that the defense just played. Still a dumbass, though. Oh, big catch! Big run! Big touchdown! Yeah, big deal. Mr. Beat for Brains ran with a ball and didn't fall down. Hey, man, you see that? That's right, you can't handle this. You can't handle what I got. Yeah, get the hell out of here, man. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They need a good return here to set up the offense. They're going to be able to return this one. First and ten. Oh, he's going berserk. The ball carrier better walk. And that's a nice run for a first down. And it's first and ten. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. And the ref is picking up a wad of singles as he runs off the field. How do you think he got those, Grim? Didn't you see him stripping on the sidelines? He's bribed, you idiot. And this is a first and long. And they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. Hopefully the next guy learns or we're going to have a pile of dead refs. First down and forever. And they needed that big run right there, Bricks. They sure fucking did, Grim. They sure fucking did. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. Yeah, good game for Tanner. I only win hours. Yeah. 
72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. play. Man, this coach must have played too many video games. You got to punt it here. Come on. Well, just when I thought only noobs would go for it on fourth for no real reason, they convert. But did they just get really lucky? Stay tuned. First and four. And they run it for a couple of yards. Second down and two. was a perfect pass, and he scores handily. Wow, two years ago, this guy was a buried, rotting corpse at the edge of the galaxy. And today, look at him. He's a dancing, scoring machine. What a story. What a, what a wonderful story. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chick wearing a wig. Two minutes left in the game, and we'll be right back. After I uh, top off my drink, what did I do with that? And it's first and ten. Oh, the defense must have called a hot potato dirty trick. That'll wake you up and then put you to sleep permanently. You snooze, you lose. Unless you're in a sleeping contest. Either the defense is trying to keep some time on the clock for their offense, or someone let a real bonehead touch the controller. And it's first and ten. And that player just transformed into a giant. Good luck. Oh, he fumbled that one. Everyone loves being on the highlight reel, leaping over a defender, but sometimes you get hit hard and have the ball knocked loose. Ah, oh, that was a close one. And he picks up eight yards on a strong run. Second down and two. And into the end zone with a burst of speed. I think he's warming down as guy did a speed feed grip. He's running from his team. It's clear. Hey, man, nobody can touch me when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, pal? And here comes the extra point attempt. It's good. The 
home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Oh, mama! He just knocked him into the next time zone! Once he finds his head, he'll be okay! The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense, you moron. Oh, look at this guy break tackles. He takes a lick and it keeps on ticking. Second down. The quarterback is controlling the clock right now like the clock is into it. He just cock-blocked the clock. And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. And the defense was reading him like a book. What? Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutiny. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. And it's first and ten. He just exploded into flames. Now the defense has to try to tackle a running bonfire. He could go all the way. See that move, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that because I'm too fast. <laughs> Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What? And kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sitters. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what's the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense calls plays at the line of scrimmage and plays really fast. Why would they do that? How many times we have to And he held on to that one for a first down. <laughs> the mutants walk away defeated. And let's go down to the field and hear the MVP. He's a real role model for the kids, Bricks. That is, if you want your kids to be a roid raging narcissist with uncontrollable verbal diarrhea. Well, that personality disorder has a name. It's called autotrumpism. Grim Blitzro with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microheart Corporation. They get it right every...